Hey guys, Sarah Ulmer here for the Y'all Politics Weekly Wrap Up. If you didn't know, the election is coming up just days around the corner. On November the 3rd, you will head to the polls for this year's general election. On the ballot will be things like the next president of the United States, a Senate seat, congressional seats, initiatives regarding marijuana, as well as the flag. If you're not sure what's going to be on the ballot and you want to brush up before you head to the polls on Tuesday, be sure to visit our site at www.yallpolitics.com so you can find out a little bit more on, on what to expect and see a sample ballot so you're not surprised when you get there. You can also check out our website if you want to hear from Secretary of State Michael Watson on what precautions are being taken this year in light of COVID-19. In the last final stretches of their race, Hyde Smith and SB speak out on the issues one last time in the Mississippi Matters on WAPT. You can find that interview as well on our website. The Mississippi Senate swore in two new members this week. Jason Barrett and Bart Williams were sworn in by Lieutenant Governor Delbert Hoseman after a special election and a runoff that happened earlier this month. More and more officials are taking sides on medical marijuana and whether or not they will be voting for or against Initiative 65 or Initiative 65A. Be sure to read all of the material regarding Initiative 65 as well as 65A before making your vote on Tuesday. Those initiatives, again, will be on the ballot as well as a new flag initiative and a resolution regarding the election of statewide officials. Thanks for tuning in with us this week, everybody. Don't forget to join us on Tuesday night for election night coverage with Y'all Politics. We'll begin at 730. Y'all have a safe weekend. I'm Sarah Ulmer.